we made our own uh, program for Lego Mindstorms, and it's fairly simple. It's a very, very simple program. The only thing complicated is the actual building itself and balancing it. So what's so, it called? It's a it's merry-go-round. So with these horses, they're actually from Lego Friends and Lego Elves. So, so their they feet have, don't. Their feet are, are very are compatible. So we have to. It's a little tricky to get them to balance, but once they're on and pushed down, they stick. So in the building the other base, we had to we had to put the wheels up, and then we had to build these little spokes. Uh -huh, to, to connect them things. so they won't go, like, as they're spinning, go, like, wah, 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 Oh, and that, so that's why you have this. It's just Yeah, support. that's why we have all these yeah. beams all over the place so that they don't, like, go, have, like, spinning on their we own. We also have this thick black gear underneath the, bo the bottom of the motor that we're not using. I can't see. To balance it out some more so it doesn't lean to one side. Okay, take it out and show me. So, it goes, okay. like, thick black gear, just slides it and You should just, just build a whole under. structure to hold your gears. That's the thing. With the Lego, you, only using the Lego Mindstorm pieces, it's near impossible because they don't have any compatible pieces that let us turn it into bricks. And working with these bricks are, is very hard. Okay. The only thing but, that we really have to build with are the little bars and these little connector pieces. Mm -hmm. But it, we found something that works. So, very simple program. So, it's just a play button on a repeat that goes to unlimited. And a uh, big, large motor in port C on our Bluetooth that goes out of power. Not of Bluetooth, the brick. Brick, yeah. That goes, that is, goes 30 as far as like power wise and it will go for 15 seconds and then break at and then it will stop at the end and then we have this timer which goes on for 50 seconds which gives us plenty of time to load on the next batch of people on the merry-go-round but yeah so basically we can start by Loading it up. I and have it works a bunch with of all of them, including the Lego friends and Lego elves. Oh, they I just have to stand. Half. They just have to stand up. So we load them all on, make them sit down or stand up. You do want to be careful though with the horses again because they will not. You can't put too much pressure on them because then they will bend. Yeah, we have to ball. hold them while we're putting Lego figures on. And then let's put my Lego fig or Minecraft figures. Can you hold this? Sure. Thanks. So I'll fit that thing on. Oh, so this boat is from a Lego Minecraft set. Mm -hmm. Since most Mary Grounds have chairs. Oh, I need to switch these on. because the creeper can't ride on anything but the boat. So you're backwards. Okay, your friend. You have one more horse. And then let's do my other Lego friends character. Her. Eh, let's do her. Eh, Heidi, you're gonna have to hold it so I can get Emily back in back in the duck. The swords are actually made out we'll of the same. Get her in the duck. Okay, there you can hold it. Okay. So then make sure the gear is in place. Hold it like try to make. The trick is you have to make your hand flat, or else the beams will come by and scrape you. But just like yeah. you have to hold it firm, but hold your hand straight and flat against the brick. We then, tried to do the power at 50, but when we tried that in our test drive, it, just it went flew crazy. all over the Every, place. All of the pieces just went crazy. So, but we lost if you do 30, then that's a nice power. It'll be nice and gentle like a regular merry-go-round, but it won't be too boring. Yeah. So let's start this thing. And then if you have like a tablet or you can open YouTube, then you can choose some music to play while you For example, we ball. picked Candyland. <laughs> because everyone knows that Merry Go Rants have music. And then it stops so we can get the next batch on. Okay, let's try it with music. 
because the music is cool. It really gets you pumped up. <laughs> So how is this connected to your brick? Show me those connections. So we have the button we are not using. We tried to figure, we tried to hook it up so that it would start when you push the button, but for some reason it wouldn't work. Yeah. But, and the uh, large motor is in port C, as you can see there. What's this? That, that is the, the button, button that we tried. touch sensor that it didn't oh. work. We didn't pull it out we yet. We tried to get it so that I could press it. And then and it would start, but for some reason, it, we couldn't get it to work. Yeah, like, so I would push just, the button, and it would go, but then I was like, okay, I wonder what happens if I don't push the button. And then the motor, and then it would just start spinning. Yeah. Mm. I'm sure there's some way to do it, and some brainiac can't, out there can do it, but we can't. Can't you program it to where this is a start button? Uh, no. No? no. With this, we can only make it to the program. Okay, okay. is your Pandora on? Yeah. Okay. okay. Okay, let's start this thing for real. <laughs> if I just look at the wheel, then it's really hypnotizing. It is really hypnotizing, so don't look directly at the wheel. Oh, and then it stops so we can load the next batch on. But yeah, you can change the time depending on, like, how much time you need, but we did 50 seconds because that's about good for changing your characters. But it's not needed. You can always press the stop button, load them on, and then press the play button again. All right, I think that's it. Mm-hmm. Yep. Hope you enjoyed this.